Alrighty, all this is K1 Locks. Today I come at you with an ESP lock. This is, uh, you know, a, a Canadian lock. I can't think of the name of it right now. But uh, we're going to try to pick it. And the reason we're going to try to pick it, this is for Sock Lock Sunday. And, because I haven't done one for a while, and I'm really bad at picking stock locks. It's just not good at feeling those regular pins, man. Oh, hey. Okay. Okay. Sorry. I guess I am not too bad at picking them. Oh, well. Well, that's all right. Let's go ahead and uh, open this sucker up. Hopefully this is small enough. Show this is the standard. Oh, let me uh, back this up just there. All right. Probably gonna have to mute all of the fucking music for this, but uh, I'll try to do the best I can, but hopefully no one gives a shit. This is something my old man was playing earlier today and I just, just didn't stop it, so. All right, as you can see here, there's been nothing done to the core, of course. Why would there be? Oh, wow. And the springs in this is not... the damn spring man shit you know it's always a good thing to pick a, a standard lock man because like those challenge locks can Start to get the feel for them and what they what they're telling you and all this and that, you know. Uh, let me zoom in for you here. As you can see, all standard. Uh, the nice thing about this one is that they got pins here. They have a flat top here, and it's not super super beveled, so it doesn't really give it away. It kind of does, but it doesn't really. So, um, but. Uh, thank you so much for watching guys today uh this has been a stock lock sunday one of the first i've done for a while and uh i'll see you guys next wednesday uh this is k1 locks saying be safe be legal and be the lock